Waza Strijders van ND Alliantie ben ik. En welkom bij een nieuwe aflevering van S Dusk Vals. Voor aflevering hebben wij de eerste chapter gecompleet. En volgens mij kunnen we dat met Explore Story terugzien. Explore Story Tree. Dit is namelijk uh, eigenlijk heel simpel de keuze die we hebben gemaakt. En zoals je kan zien, kan je verschillende uh, routes afspelen. Verschillende keuzes die je kan maken. En leiden ook tot verschillende stukken. En als we binnen drie afleveringen de eerste chapter hebben uitgespeeld. Is het misschien nog wel eens interessant om te kijken wat er verder allemaal nog kan gebeuren. Op een later moment. Laten we gewoon de game allereerst gewoon maar eens even afspelen. Dus laten we maar gewoon lekker gelijk verder gaan. Ik zou stellen, uh, klik hier op continue. Klik op play solo en we gaan weer. Um, vind je deze serie nou leuk? Uh, laat het me vooral weten. En vertel me... Of je meer van dit soort content wil zien in de toekomst. En een duimpje omhoog of een comment. Dat is altijd leuk om te zien. Dus ja, we gaan er gewoon voor. Het last wat we wisten is dat er zeg maar uh, een gun... Uh, werd afgeschoten, maar wat dat inhoudt weten we nog niet. Overigens vind ik de intro's of de muziek in deze game echt fantastisch. Dit is zeg maar de, de intro song. Let's go. I told you I wasn't gonna hurt anyone. But you are really pushing your luck. Dale, get the duffel bag. We're out of here. Yeah, precies. Oh my god. I thought I'd lost you. Me too. My legs are shaking. Vince, you can't try to fight these people. I know why you did it, but you just can't. I don't know what I was thinking. If he'd really done it, with Zoe watching, it was stupid. No, it was brave. Just don't get us killed. Daddy, did they hurt you? Oh, sweetie, I'm fine. <sighs> Two days from now, we'll be in St. Louis, and it'll be like none of this ever happened. <gasps> the police. Guys, we're not going anywhere. Fuck! It's Dante. He'll get us out of here. You got more faith in him than I do. Okay. Ik weet dat het een resultaat is van wat wij eerder in de vorige aflevering hebben gedaan. Wellicht dat het een logisch uh, gevolg is van hoe de game zou moeten spelen. Jay, check they can't get in the back. We're not talking with this asshole. Right? Dante will get us out. He's too strong minded for his own good half the time. But he gets things done. <laughs> okay. What does that mean? He's gonna help us, right? He's sheriff of the smallest county in Arizona, but acts like he's the king of the Southwest. He can be a hell of a headache, but hopefully the headache we need. Wonder if he knows Ash isn't here tonight. Ash is your son? Yeah. Best thing I ever did. We're sitting ducks here. I say we stick to the plan. Take our chances with a hostage. The back gate's chained up. There's no way in. Tyler, I don't know. Maybe we should just give ourselves... Don't say it. 
Romero's impatient, and these small town cops couldn't catch a cold. Our best move is to wait. Okay. Is someone gonna get that? The police are gonna catch you and put you in jail. You cut it out or I'll put you in a corner. Hey! You can't talk to my granddaughter like that. She's six years old. She's just speaking her mind. Yeah, I'm speaking my mind. <laughs> Enough! Next person who talks is going in the back office. There's a second phone back there. If you could reach Dante without them knowing. Okay. Um. You're not gonna put anyone in that office. Believe me, I will. No offense, but I think you're just hot wind. All right, that's it. Into the back. No, don't separate us. He'll stay quiet. Michelle, it's fine. It's not fine. None of this is fine. I think you both need a little time out. Jay, make sure nobody answers the damn phone. <laughs> Keep your mouth shut and don't make me come in here again. Okay. Sheriff calls again. Good thinking. Can you get your hands free? Yeah, it's no good. It's too tight. All right. How do we do this? Friction, maybe. Or we use scissors. Or we use scissors. Yeah, that's what I was also going to check. That's not handy. It. It's gonna fall. Try to cover the noise. I'll cough. On three. One, two. <laughs> okay. If it's the cops, they're gonna keep calling. Can you reach the scissors? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'll block the door. Okay. I'm in the Desert Dream Motel. Can you connect me directly to the sheriff? This is Sheriff Romero. Who am I talking to? My name is Vincent Walker, and I'm my family. We're hostages in here. Whoa, slow down there, Vince. Uh, I can help you, but you gotta relax those nerves first. All right? I may not have much time. Drie man. Um. The people doing this, there's three of them. The manager said they're the um, the Holt boys. Oh no, shit. <laughs> well, that explains a few things. Yeah, like what? It's a long story, but tonight's gonna be the end of it. Okay. You're good. Keep going. Um. Even denken. Ja, die jongste moet zich zeven vinden. They call Jay. He's just a kid. I don't even think he wants to be here. Probably bullied into it, but listen, it's good to identify a weak link for us and and for you. Hey. They've blocked the door. Shit, Vince, this door won't hold. Okay. Um. The one calling the shots. I think his name's um. Tyler. Tyler. That's right. He's coiled up pretty tight. I worry what's going to happen if something sets him off. Huh. I would have called him the one with the cool head. You need to be careful. I'm almost out of time. Listen, Vince, we're gonna put an end to this thing sooner than you think. Just keep your eyes open, okay? 
Okay. Next time you talk to one of my hostages behind my back, I take him to the window and shoot him. Keep your people 30 yards from the motel and don't call us again. What did you tell him? Nothing. I didn't have time. You're lying to me. He's not. They barely said hello. These cops, they might work for the county, but they are loyal to him. And he does not care about any of us. And you okay. do? Leaving you two alone together was a dumb idea. Let go! That hurts! You should never have come to Two Rock. Je had nooit een fucking huis moeten overvallen, of daarvan. Oh, stroom uitgezet. Oké, okay, interesting. Er gebeurt een hele hoop, dus ik ben voornamelijk stil. Ik bedoel, het volgen van het verhaal is waarschijnlijk interessanter dan mij hoort praten. Let's see. 12 years as a flight mechanic. Pretty high up. Then, one day, bam. Bits of engine all over the hangar. Two workers hospitalized and another in the morgue. All because you left a lug nut loose on a DC-10. No, that wasn't me. It was a faulty compressor disc. The airline was cutting corners. I kept warning them, but... It's still your word against theirs. My advice? Sign the form. Take the money. It's a generous offer. It's a gag order. If I sign that, it's professional suicide. Look, I keep the check. It won't even cover my rent for a year. All I want is my job back. Mr. Walker, with all due respect, you'll never work for an airline again regardless. Now, do yourself a favor. Pick up the pen. No. Dat ben ik niet voor plan. Kunnen we nog een andere optie krijgen? You can stick your gag order and your pen right up your ass. Oh, so you do have a little fight left in you, huh? <sighs> Shit. <clears throat> Hello? Sorry. I'm probably busy packing. I just picked Zoe up from swimming. We'll be home soon. Everything okay? Oh, uh... Yeah, yeah, I just... I just had the strangest dream. I was back in the lawyer's office. A dream? At this time of day? While I was packing, you know, like... Dreaming... About our, our new life in Missouri. As long as everything's boxed up and in good shape for the landlord. I know this move is a big step, and tons of stress, but... I've got a really good vibe about it, man. We'll be back by seven. I'm just gonna pick up Chinese. <sighs> Zoe! Sorry, gotta go. Sure, okay, but. Okay, so I short fun, so maar genaaid door het bedrijf waar die werkte. All right, big man, you got until seven to get this apartment ship shape and ready to go. Where do you want to start? Okay. Laten we maar beginnen met opruimen van de dishes. Oh, dat is wel grappig gedaan. Daar zijn de minigames hoe ze dit hebben gedaan, is wel grappig gedaan. All right, dish is done. Even de airco fixen. Oké. This is anything like the cold air unit on a flight deck. There should be. Well, this is obviously alien technology. There we go. Ethereal. Thermostat control. It's AC. By minutes. <laughs> I feel yeah, more. We're good. We're good. What's next? What is next? Um, boxes. Some dreams never get off the ground. And 
Als goed hebben we dan al zo alles gedaan. Alright, on the home stretch now. Wat mis ik nog? Back photos. Ja, kijk, ik doe gewoon netjes alles wat ik moest doen. Kijk, je kan ook zomaar gaan lopen kloten. Seems like I'm packing my whole world away. Ja, dit klinkt redelijk bekend. Ik ben namelijk zelf ook bezig voor het, uh, voor het kopen van een appartement. En uh... A bit of a cool start to the day, gradually getting warmer, with a high of around 93 degrees. En eigenlijk, dus ik ben nog niet in de, in de packing stage, ik, ga nog, ik ben nog niet uit huis. Maar ik zit wel in, uh, dit zijn wel dingen waar ik, waar ik te maken mee ga krijgen. Het is wel interessant. Oh, what the hell, ref? My kid can make a better call than that. Daddy! Hi, pumpkin. How was your last day? Okay, I guess. Millie gave me her address, but I'm gonna miss her. No, I hear you. It's a big change for everyone. We'll write to her as soon as we get to St. Louis. Okay, gotta help mommy now. Why don't you run upstairs and get your PJs on? Are you gonna put me to bed tonight? Sure thing, kiddo. <laughs> I know you worked hard today, so I got you your favorite. Mmm, hmm, shrimp. By the way, did the moving company call? Um, nope. Awesome. You took care of everything. Kijk. Hey, Buster, of course I did. Vince's moving company at your service. Why, yes, <laughs> we do accept tips. That might be taking it too far. Oh, I don't know. I'll be living on handouts if I mess up this new job. You remember what you told me when I got laid off from the tax office? Make sure you empty the stationary cupboard on your way out? <laughs> no. You told me that change only hurts when you try to stop it happening. And you were right. If I hadn't gotten laid off, I would never have finished my PhD application or gotten my job at the university. I get it. Focus on the positives. God, I'm starving. Zoe's already eaten, but I haven't had a chance all day. I'll get her ready for bed when you get noodled up. Zeg dat nooit meer. Noodelt up. Come on. Let's get your jammies on. En daar ga ik het eindigen voor deze aflevering. Mensen, ik dank je voor het kijken. Like, abonneer, reageer. En deel met je vrienden. En ik jullie de volgende keer weer terug te zien. Bij een nieuwe aflevering. Van S Dusk Falls. See ya.